thing is, people are like, why would you spend 300 on ruined trainers? And I just think, yeah, why would you? But fashion is fashion, is fashion. Because I like them. I like things that are old. So I absolutely love these. welcome back to my channel so today is all about the golden goose unboxing i'm ecstatic i can't wait to show you my new babies and talk you through why i bought them but before we get into this video if you're brand new to this channel i want you guys to hit that subscribe button i do videos sundays tuesdays and wednesdays sometimes on mondays as well if i've got more content to put out so i'm going to give you a few seconds to hit that subscribe button while i wait for you to subscribe have you hit the subscribe button okay let's get into the video what's this another yellow bag yes okay so i was in selfridges i bought this a while back but i'm just doing the unboxing now and i got these golden goose trainers Ta-da! so basically everyone has been raving about these trainers how comfortable they are i think at first they're not really that comfortable but after a while because it is like a leather sole base it gets really comfortable so i've just been seeing them and i wanted to get a black pair and like a white glittery pair although i didn't get a white pair so let's see what pair i got I absolutely love these. So, these are them. One. Two. I don't know if they actually have a specific name. Let me check. So, these are the Golden Goose It Star F6 trainers in grey. I got them in a 36 because I am a 36. Although they look quite bigger, they look quite big for a 36, no? But yeah, this is the colour grey, although I don't really feel like it's a grey. Okay, so basically I realised that these are not the Midstar trainers because the wrong label was on them. These are the Superstar A6 trainers in black. So I think somewhere in this video I say that they're £345, but because the label was wrong, I realised that they were probably somewhere between 285 and 290 pounds so just to clear that up sorry for this epic fail guys right i think it's more of a charcoal black but uh anyway and they were 345 pounds and i absolutely love them i've been wanting these trainers forever i know like when i said i wanted to get these trainers a lot of people were like why do you want to get these trainers they look as if they're damaged like why would you pay 345 pounds for trainers that look like they're scuffed um my mum is like the most funniest person when it comes to stuff like this i went to visit my mum this is a few years back like she's always been in tune with fashion but now sh she understands the trends but this was quite a few years back she literally stormed in the room and she was just like to me you know i've raised you really well and you're a grown woman and your boots are scuffed it's disgusting i was like what is she on about and she's like so i've um i noticed them in the hallway because we were sitting in the sitting room and i went to the cupboard and i went to go and find some black polish because we've scuffed these boots and they're just disgusting i was like what did you polish my boots she was like yes I've polished your boots because the way you treat things it's disgusting you spend money on things and you just ruin them and I was like mum that's the style they're meant to be scuffed uh it's like a military look and she was just like oh okay well I've polished your boots for you <laughs> what a sport child I am great story bros great story but the point I'm making is if you even look at the detail of the shoe like it's very scuffed even like the lace details, they've got like black print on them. I absolutely love these trainers. And they're genuine leather and they're made in Italy because it's like they're scuffed, but they're not really. And on the back they say Golden Goose Deluxe brand. Well, Golden Goose DB. And these are what they look like on. I just love them. I think they're so cute. They're so comfortable. I always like to get things that are very eccentric, very different from the norm. I really don't like to get things that everyone gets like I could have gone and got a pair of Valentino trainers or Balenciaga, although I do have a pair of Balenciagas and I'm going to do an unboxing soon. But at the end of the day, I just love these. I think these are absolutely lovely. The thing is, people are like, why would you spend 300 on ruined trainers? 
and I just think yeah why would you but fashion is fashion is fashion so I absolutely love these I'm gonna try and see if I can find a link for these if I can I'll pop them in the description box below but yes that's the end of the video I hope you like this video and if you do why not give it a thumbs up what do you guys genuinely think I know a lot of you are gonna be like why on earth you buy these damn trainers because I like them I like things that are old like I said I do videos Sunday Tuesday and Wednesday so stay tuned for the next video but if you want to see more of me why not follow me on my Instagram I'm gonna leave the links below and you can also follow me on my other social media platforms but other than that I guess I'll see you in another video and remember guys to always stay what bougie